Hey everyone and welcome back to another YouTube video. It's your girl Tyra D and I'm back with another video. If you like my videos before this, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to your girl. And yeah, let's get right into this video. You already know, first things first, we have to set the vibes. So I'm lighting this candle in the vanilla bean and caramel scent and it smells so, so good. And it even crackles, which is amazing. Before getting into the shower, I need to exfoliate my skin using a dry brush. I always use a dry brush every single time, like I never skip this step, just because I want to make sure any dirt, grime, or dead skin cells are off my body before I get it wet. Before touching any part of my body, I need to make sure my hands are clean first. So I'm going to go ahead and wash my hands using this antibacterial soap. And this soap is actually called Detol. I'm going to get a little more into it later on in the video, but this is a really good soap to exfoliate your skin with. For oral hygiene, I'm going in with my usual, the Arm & Hammer Baking Soda Toothpaste. I already told you guys about this toothpaste. I love how it foams at the mouth and doesn't have a scent because I really do hate the pasty things. It just isn't for me and I prefer to use this kind of toothpaste. For skincare, I'm going in with my holy grail, Curology. This cleanser is really it. It's so gentle yet gets the job done and it really did clear up my skin as well as using the medication but this is definitely a go-to and I really do notice a change in my skin when I go a couple days without using it. So if you haven't purchased it already for yourself, go ahead and do that right now. For hair care, I'm going in with my usual, the Herbal Essence Hello Hydration Shampoo in the scent Coconut. This is definitely my go-to shampoo. I sometimes use Garnier or like an avocado one, but this one just smells so good. It's so fresh and it leaves my scalp feeling so nourished, like it literally hydrates my scalp. So that's why I prefer to use this over any other product. And it really does get the job done and smells amazing. Tell me he's reckless You say that he's selfish You know that I'm jealous You're getting all of your love You just don't get enough As a base cleanser, I'm going in with the Method Body Wash And this is in the scent Coconut and Rice Milk Y'all already know I've been going off about this coconut thing Like the coconut, rice milk, macadamia nut I've been going off about these products Because I genuinely love them so much And it smells so good And they all get the job done the way it's supposed to be look how it's lathering up on my skin it leaves my skin super shiny super soft like the products i tell you guys to use i use them in real life this is not sponsored content nothing of the sort these are things i genuinely use and i genuinely love so when i talk about these things and tell you that you should buy it girl come on you gotta get you one of these so pack up all your things by next weekend yeah. you couldn't do one day so she just went my way now i got it covered every weekend 
Tell me if you're in the mood for a little bit more of us No worries, I got you on the weekdays too Cause I know you need way more Damn, bless him more You want me on us Just tell me you want me on Monday And I'll be at your door Ready to take his place Ready to give you what you've been missing every day What you've been waiting for 10.30, no later than So I can tell your man what do you want Your girl is your girl But man, your girl's gonna be mine soon Your girl tells her girl she wants to be mine too Tuesday and Wednesday, Thursday and Friday Maybe I could just slide through the weekend, yeah. When that Monday comes, I'm a new man, no oh. So pack up all your things by next weekend You couldn't do one day, so she just went my way For our scents of the day, I'm going in with the Native Body Wash in the scent Lilac and White Tea. This is not coconut or macadamia nut, but I must say the smell does resemble those type of scents, sort of, kind of, but it also goes well with the coconut and rice milk scent. Like it's a, what's the word I'm looking for? It complements the smell without doing too much. And as always, it lathers up the way I like it. The texture is amazing. Going in with an African net definitely tops it all off because I'm exfoliating my skin while getting deep in there and nourishing my skin. It's just an amazing feeling. So definitely get you one of these. And as I said before, you have to buy yourself an African net. I have so many of these in different colors. I purchased them on Amazon because they do come three or four in a pack. It's definitely worth the buy. So I'm gonna link it down below and make sure you get yourself one of these. To exfoliate my skin, I'm going in with the Tree Hut Exfoliator. This is in the scent Pink Hibiscus. This scent also complements the rice milk, lilac, and white tea. All the scents I put together, even though they are different and all different brands, they do complement each other with the scents. So I went in with this exfoliator, and I've talked about the Tree Hut brand before. The exfoliating is nice, but it's not, you know, as hard as ancient cosmetics but i will say that this exfoliator and this scent was a little bit more scratchy than my other ones like the watermelon or the coconut lime this one definitely went in it was very scratchy but i was a little mm, like i questioned about how it just looks on my skin like as you guys can see right here it looked like it gave like soapy almost vibe like i don't know it just gave i don't know it wasn't giving what i would normally want to see when i'm exfoliating my skin it just looked like I don't know it just like you 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 see what i mean it's not the same it's it's really not the same but it did get the job done so it just is what it is and it does smell really good to exfoliate my girl downstairs once again i'm going in with the bush balm ingrown hair exfoliating scrub now this scrub the texture seems super super hard and abrasive as you can see here it looks like rock salt but i must say it is very nourishing and very soft once it is on your skin it has so many different oils in it it's really a great product like you guys should definitely check this out it really did bring the moisture back to my girl downstairs 
before shaving I'm going in with the EOS dry skin shave cream this is in the scent coconut oil and this shaving cream is super super soft for the skin while hydrating and nourishing so after my shave my skin feels super soft <laughs> For foot care, I'm going in with the Dr. Teal Gentle Exfoliant. I really love this product. As you can see, it is squeezed out because it really does get the job done. It's super gentle on my feet while getting the job done. And on top of that, it smells really good. So my feet after this smell amazing. For my after shower care, I'm going to first moisturize my lips using Vaseline as always. And then I'm going to head on to my skincare using my 4-in-1 face oil by Angel Cosmetics. I really love this oil, y'all. Y'all see me use it every single time because it really is moisturizing and it's super lightweight. Like, it's not too oily. So, it's perfect for the skin and it doesn't cause any further acne on my face because you guys already know I cleared up my skin. So, I don't want to revert back, you know? To moisturize my girl downstairs i'm gonna be using both the v gentle and the bush balm ingrown hair oil y'all this combo together is perfect and it works great for my girl downstairs so that i don't get any ingrowns to moisturize my body i'm going in with the eos 24 hour moisture body lotion in the scent vanilla cashmere y'all already heard me talk about this product before it is super hydrated and it smells so so good like it's giving scrumptious for my outfit of the day, I'm throwing on my baby blue Lululemon set. This set is super comfortable and perfect for my activities for later in the day. And I just paired it with my Yeezys, which are also the same color. And y'all, for the rest of my day, I had a pretty productive day. First, I went to go get some breakfast with my friend Mel. We had just got some oatmeal bowls and smoothies just to start our day because we did end up going to Pilates later in the day. And y'all, bangle bowls, fire. Like the smoothie I had was super, super good and it was very, you know, nutritious, which was perfect. And it was like a meal supplement, which worked out for me. And then afterwards, like I said, I went to Pilates and y'all, I'm really taking my health very serious this year. I really want to get my body right from the inside out. And of course, I want to look good. So I'm taking these different steps to change my diet as well as getting more active and getting more sleep just so that I could have, you know, a different body, like a healthier body. So yeah that's how my day went i had a really good day and y'all don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel i appreciate all your support and i'm so thankful to each and every one of you who are subscribed and comment on my videos i love you guys so much and i'll see y'all in my next video bye